Our ports are crucial hubs in the flow of goods to and from Europe. Ships, river barges, trucks and trains are constantly in motion, moving containers to and from port cities day and night. The port is the start and end point of the European supply chain. The European Commission sees this as a huge opportunity to accelerate the green transition of the transport sector. Ports can become decisive when it comes to the supply and use of green energy carriers. In the Magpie project, four ports and 41 other partners from six different countries have united to investigate how this role in the energy transition can best be shaped. The research focuses on four green energy carriers, hydrogen, batteries, ammonia and biofuels, their effect on the various modes of transport, the associated network of refueling and charging stations, the market and legislation. Ten demonstrations and three tools will be developed under this ambitious research and innovation project. Alternative fuels, energy efficiency and renewable electricity in ports will be improved thanks to on-site biofuel production, ammonia bunkering to seagoing vessels, the use of smart energy systems, shore power peak shaving and the development of digital tools. Maritime operations will become safer and more sustainable thanks to the deployment of offshore charging buoys, autonomous e-barges and automated cargo transshipment, and hydrogen and electric power for barges. More than ever, the port and its hinterland will be strongly interconnected through hybrid locomotives for in-port shunting operations. The electrification of trucks by central truck decoupling and autonomous charging and digitally connected trucks which prevent bottlenecks. Based on the demonstrated solutions and results, the Magpie partners will develop a master plan for the transition to green ports in Europe. We'll take into account the different types, sizes and geographical locations. The Magpie Consortium will build the smart green port of the future.